Okay, hey guys, and welcome to another video. This video is gonna be interesting because I'm at a, I guess it's a convention. It's called LA's Most Haunted, and it's at a relic museum, which I think is cool. Uh, from what I've seen online, it looks amazing inside. But look at how it looks out here. Very, like nothing's going on. So, um, yeah, let's get in there. Okay, guys, so just waiting in the car right now. And I noticed that there's people that are cosplaying as Margot Robbie and Brad Pitt's character in the movie Once Upon a Time in Hollywood, right there, going inside the door. We'll see them when we get in there, I guess. Hey guys, so I'm inside the Relic Museum now. It's really super cool. I'll show you everything in a second. But the reason why I'm here is because David Omen wrote a book. Hello. Where's the other one? I don't know. Maybe you don't know. Oh, thank God. How's it going? I don't know. Hi, all. Are you live streaming? Mm-hmm. Hey. <coughs> Excuse me. It's David Oman from the Oman House. I'm here to promote my new book. Can you guys see that? Goes to Cielo Drive. That's right. That's my new book. It just came out last week, and I'm out here selling it. And that's selling me. David. <laughs> In any event. Hot babe alert, guys. Yeah, whatever. Hot whatever. <laughs> so, we're here at this event with Bridget. I just saw Bridget and some other mm -hmm. people that I don't know that I just met for the first time. Bridget was in Playboy. She was the girl's next door. She wasn't in Playboy. Oh, she was the girl next door. She was Hugh in Hefner's the girl's girl? next door. You know, with Holly Madison and the other ones. And Hugh Hefner. Hugh the man Hefner. Oh, the whatever. chick magnet. Of all chick magnets. They call him the John of Johns. The John of Johns. You hear that, guys? And David knows her. She's the one that hooked him up with this thing. And he is... I'll show you all the stuff that he has set up for it right now. But I'm here to kind of like, you know, help him. He has a little table set up here. Well, not yet, but it will be set up for his book and the movie. We have this so far. We also brought this with the pictures and all that. Huge stand. This here. And this is going to be the area where we're going to set up and have everything to sell. But check it out. Look at this place. This isn't the coolest thing ever. God, what is And the coolest part, David brought walkie-talkie, so if I want to talk to him, I just talk to him on here. The battery's low, David, what the heck? But yeah, so, I'll, I'll talk to him soon. <laughs> you guys will hear me. Really cool. Okay guys, I actually remember having these little like Transformer burgers and McNuggets. I have those somewhere. Look at that. Is this my thumbnail? I think so. Even have the kernel in there. Ooh, I just I just keep seeing more and more cool stuff.
Let's look at that. Onion rings, 30 cents. French fries, potatoes, 19 cents. Burger with cheese, only 49. And see, let me show you. This is where I am. Or yesterday meets today. Today. See? Very cool. Oh, look at this. Oh, this is something from the drive-in. You know when you go to the drive-in and you have to hook up your car to the antenna so you can hear the movie? That's what this is. See? Look at that. Paul's like, is this all money, but not donations? <laughs> look at this, like, old school jewelry. Look at Paramount Pictures matchbook. 20th Century Fox matchbook. So this is the setup so far. We got the shirt, postcards for this is for the movie, David's movie. These are pictures from the house. These are old photographs here. This is the 1960s yeah, kind of photos. Take a look. Okay. There. These are photos from the 1960s. The way the house looked when Sharon was living there, murdered. This is David Oman's book here. The Ghost of Cielo Drive, The Afterlife of Sharon Tate and the Spirits of the Omen House by David Omen. We also have postcards. And we got the little setup there. So David can live stream. And he has the markers to sign if you wish to have your book signed. So this is the setup. There we go. We got the huge poster, the smaller signs, everything set up here, and of course, the ghost. That race. This, this event is called LA's Most Haunted, and they're going to have panels here. Isn't this the coolest panel room ever? Like, come on, look at this car! So cool! They even have a Pioneer Chicken sign. Amazing. Special thanks to, I'm going to go to the second line, Scott Michaels and Julia, the Pirates, who has been incredible detail business, and information on the Shantae Brothers, and always bringing over some of the coolest to that, the one at this environment. In the next edition, and I think that's a lot of fun. Yes, you've got a few people coming. All of a sudden, it's like, you're talking to Saturday, and 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 you're talking to Thank <laughs> you. 
Can you hear me? Over. Can you hear me? Over. Just wanted to say, hell yeah, over. Coolest day ever. <laughs> okay guys, so right now, as David's mingling, I'm just kind of taking care of the booth. Right now I'm the representator, representator. Right now I'm representing David Oman's booth, so yeah. Here we go having to talk to people, oh my god. Okay guys, so everyone's over there doing panels. I can kind of show you guys everything here. Look at this, the Universal Studios and the studio to our paper map thing. Ooh, nods to my gun. TV guide, where are we supposed as actor? Look at that. Oh, I thought that's such a noise. I was gonna get happy. Look at these creepy movies. Oh my god, that looks like my book! It's Benji. Oh, I used to like that movie. Movie Ranch. That's what the whole house looks like from here. Are you checking up on your house? Like the house should think so. I said I hope so, but I hope we can get a signal on it. Yep, got a signal on the house. What's going on? Are they having I, a party without you? Is it like the haunted mansion? Yeah. Big They're party, dancing? Big, big, big party. Bow and dancing. In the nice. Who's Sharon sure dancing with? Pisses me off, whoever the fuck he is. <laughs> so, what do you think of the event so far? Uh, say something nice. It's, it's pleasant being out here tonight. Let me tell you, I'm having the time of my life, or afterlife for that matter. Great. Why am I not getting it to turn? It's not readjusting for some reason. It's supposed to. I'm looking in front of the house right now. <coughs> looking at the cameras. Always. So ever since the movie... The, the, yes, there's still people coming up there to this very day. There's so many people coming up today. I saw about two dozen people drive up. And I mean cars, not people, but cars drive up there. It's crazy. Ever since the Tarantino movie. Unbelievable. All days, all times of day and at night they're coming up to look to see the Shine Tate house. And I'm like, they're turning on my driveway. I'm like, when... <laughs> you should install like a huge microphone and be like, get out, or you're under arrest, or something crazy. Yeah, that would be something smart to do. Yeah. Making strangers really So then they'd be really scared. Why well, do I want to scare really nice uh, You people. gotta scare strangers. No, I don't scare strangers. That's, that's You welcome them into your home, actually. <laughs> For a small fee. <laughs> For no fee, I've invited people into my home. What do you mean this fee, crap? Yeah. I don't charge anybody. Any stranger can get into David's house. For free. <laughs> so how any stranger can get into my house for free? God, you're terrible. I was a stranger in 2013, and look at us now. Why do you roll your eyes? Yes, look at us now. <laughs> Scary. Look at how far we've come. Oh, God. <laughs> Selling David O. Is this 14 of 31? 
Oh, yes. You can make this for ten thirty one. Yes, sir. Sorry, guys. There's babes passing by. David, they they asked me on the live stream. You were talking to the famous guy. They were asking if they can choose a rush delivery for the book. Okay, it's a pay extra, of course. Okay. Otherwise, it's media mail. Okay. Yeah, you mean if they wanted to do it like Friday mail? Yeah, like they wanted it on the next day. Not next day, within two days. Printing mail flat rate envelope is um, like seven bucks plus the, you know, to have to, to have to go there to do it. But yes, they can do that. They can pay extra through PayPal. You know, it's $5 shipping. You can add $3 and we'll have it done. Okay. You heard that, guys. For whoever asked me in the live stream, I wish I was still live now, but you heard David. You heard it from his mouth. It That's scary. Happen. You heard it from the mouth of David. The omen. Okay. Hell the dark and small Actual shoes, no way. <laughs> Look at this. Bert Reynolds' boots in the way. The beast is continuing on this. Look at that. Planet of the Apes, chip face. Thank you. 
Jesus, that my thumbnail? Oh my goodness. With all these guys doing thanks, my thanks for coming over my thank you very much. After 17 years of living there, all these shows, I decided enough. They all did a picture job at me and telling a half ass story. And I said, I gotta write this gosh John book, and it's been 10 years in the process, so I finally wrote it, and that's this book. And it's like I said, it goes from 2000 to 2013, right after Zach Baggins was there to do the show. And I don't do any disrespect to Zach. I didn't think it was worthwhile to insult him, but I do go through some of the myths about the house, and I totally eviscerate <laughs> them to the point where it's like, that doesn't make sense, you're right. That's, that's bullshit. Because it's, the house wasn't built on ceremonial Native American burial grounds. What a kill of Zach says. It's not. So yeah, this place is like amazing. I love it. They just have so many cool old school things. I'll show you the planes right now. Like, oh my gosh, it's just amazing. Hi, David. I mean, Zach. I'm, I'm, I'm Zach Baggins. <laughs> ghosts beware. Don't be afraid of ghosts. Be afraid of me. I'm Zach Baggins. You should be afraid of me. How's, how's your haunted museum going? Somebody punched out one of my clowns at the museum last week. I'm fucking pissed. You don't punch people out that are performers at your museum. They're there to entertain you, to scare you. Because if the goddamn relics don't scare you, who the fuck's going to scare you, buddy? What do I know? I'm uh, Zach Baggins. Uh, what do you think about David Ullman? I know you know David Ullman. I don't like him. Why? He's one of my best friends. He lives in this house that I couldn't stand in for three hours. You know, I just get him out of there all the time. Okay, the crowd goes wild. I'm worried about that bastard, David Ullman. I don't like him. Okay. He's a creep. Oh no. He's been living there for 17 years and I managed three hours and I ran out of like chicken shit little. <laughs> Even talking about this house makes me scared. David, that has pizza on it. I don't want to hear your name, David. It's making me break out of pies. Zach, that has pizza on it. Oh my god, it does. <laughs> Oh no. I'm frozen. <laughs> I'm Zach Baggins. Be no, you don't eat, you just work out. With oh, Holly. <laughs> I work out with Holly. She works Ooh. me out. You know, it's tough being a pair of celeb, you know. Yes. Ooh. 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 Are you scared? Because I know I'm scared. I'm Zach Baggins and I'm scared of myself. Yes. I'm out of here. Oh. Wait, are you not really leaving, David? <laughs> okay, guys, so as always, just please remember to like this video if you like this video, and I'll see you guys tomorrow. Okay, bye.